Beach in St. Louis. It's time for Cardinals baseball. Game two between the Redbirds and the San Diego Pops. He's punched out 23, only walk three. He is going right after the opposition. The Finn, Fernando Tatis, Ron Acuna Jr., and Lane Thomas, who have all that fourth one last night is 22nd of the year in an OPS over a thousand the month of August. He's got a 284 ERA. That's the best on the team. Here's how he's doing it. It's coming up from Memphis. We'll see what Bob Melvin thinks about back in there at second base. Richie Palacios. And Zach's first is on the way, and we're underway. Ball one, says Mark Ripperger. That's a base hit. Palacios over quickly. And with a backhand, he'll hold fastball, it. get it inside on Kim, who's a very good breaking ball hitter. And with Juan Soto. He got a beauty. Contreras pounces. Kim didn't see it. He loses the half to stop it. As Contreras pounces, knows though he's got to be quick with the throw and sails it up the line. Be out. A hit and an error puts runners at second and third with nobody out. And Machado have home run man for San Diego. These are important games. Elbow. Good breaking ball right there by Thompson. They also have Joe Musgrove. He's on the. That's fouled away. The climb will be a steep one. On a streak so far this season. And that's perhaps the most perplexing thing of all for a team. The baseball realm, everybody thought this was going to be a big year for the Padres. But everybody thought it was going to be a big year. Pitch, 3-2. And Mason Wynn puts the squeeze on that for out number one. Tatis had a big night last night wearing his fancy Cardinal. This one over to his right makes the catch. He's got no play. He's anyhow. Yeah, you have second and third. Nobody out. You keep it to one. That's. And if there has been a problem for the Padres coming into the series, like the Cardinals, they. Good block. On a ball in the dirt. One ball, two. I tried to go hard in. That's pushed out of play to the right side. So Zach. He's got plenty of room. Great job by Zach Thompson. That could have spiraled out of control. And the Pittsburgh Pirates. Jordan Walker and Mason Wynn. Eight in San Diego. Yeah, he definitely has. 22nd start for him. He's got a little bit of everything. But you're going to see mainly the four seam and the curveball. Two years. And wanted this chance, wanted to throw more innings and provide more length. Kim to his right, off balance throw. They got Palacios out. Go, no play for Batten and an infield hit for Goldschmidt. Brad, you're going to drive home faster than Goldie's ball off the bat. Say one ball, no strikes, and that evens it up. That's more like it. 92 on the court. Yank foul. That's what that curveball does, right? All you can do is that a product of a diminishing of stuff or the fact that he's pitching more inning? I average against in all of his stuff. Yet the ERA has remained very close to where it was last year. It was a 3 2 pitch, which is cut on and missed. And there's your second out. Were you an NBA for a chance? See what he does. Well, this is one of the matchups you hope pay with two outs. He's tried to shoot that ball to right twice and is behind 0-2. And, and he takes a fastball, a surprise party from Lugo with San Diego. The amazing turnaround for Zach Thompson, who at AAA had base. It is a concentration thing, too. You know, you never know. You go back to the minor leagues. It's a little bit different. It's a very, very effective pitch for him. And it just opened things. We're seeing him use the righties and the lefties. That's it right there. You've also seen him use. And too high. It's a full count. It's on the run and glides over. That makes a nice catch for out the guys for him. Camposano catching for the Padres tonight. And was going to transfer to South Carolina and then got drafted and signed. Pick the pitch is up and away. Ball two. You don't see that setup very often, do you? Where he's got the. But at the point of contact, it's amazing how varied the up to nothing. 
short. Mason drifts back. Plenty of room to handle that. Two outs. 32nd round draft pick. Back in 2017 out of Quinnipiac to play with San Diego this year. Good for him. Yeah, made his debut last year. There. Tommy Arctic here in the second. A little low. And ball three. Zach's had to throw a lot of pitches. He's fallen behind. But he can't. Ball four. And Jose Azokar. Three full counts. The pitch. His hammer just foul. I'm starting to think, Chip, and I could be off on this. There is that Zach turns her loose and misses high. One ball, one strike. Zach's got to get the ball down. Two and one. Got some help there. It's two and two. Yeah, definitely did that cutter. Well, thank you. Yeah, that's on me. There's a breaking ball. Pulled a string, and he has his first strike. Games, including one last night. Xander Bogarts, one of their newer acquisitive lineup tonight. Wilson Contreras versus Seth Lugo, who struck San Diego. Almost got knocked to the left. What a bullet. So one away. Tough luck for Contreras. And in for a strike. And on a play to the left, a ball and two strike. 2-2. Two -two. Hey, same spot. Maybe she'll get another one. We all. No swing. It's three and two. Super. That's three two is tipped and caught. Well, he's got a really good fastball. Tyler O'Neill bats and takes a strike. Well, there's a mutual option, I think, or a player's option for Luke. Ground behind Stubby Clap has plenty of room and makes the catch. It's off the third. As Zach Thompson goes back to work, he needs some economy here. And Kim singled against him to score the game's only run. One ball, one strike. Command. Up a ground ball to third. And no one makes short work of the has been. Try to breaking ball to get into the count with Soto, who you think about that. The first two guys in the order, they have the they can both do damage. And it makes sense. I mean she's and Bogarts. He's still getting his. We pointed that out, too. He's got 20. And there we go. Ball four. He takes a walk with one out. Machado. We pointed out last night this series now with San Diego. And didn't get that. This guy has such an elegant arm. Smooth up there at the plate. He, play, he plays a game like everybody. Would. They got him through 33. Tatis Jr. through th runner goes the pitch is hit and Soto third oh maybe you got a chance what's his rep in the game I know he's had off the field troubles he's you got all the facts he's a case Arnado's coming wow. home and Soto took off with that ground position oh on to the edge of the track to make the catch Nelson thanks so much as always